Oh, hi guys. I uh, hope you're well. And um, just welcome to another video using Wolfram Mathematica. Uh, I'm just going to be doing some uh, equation solving. And uh, this assumes that you've got a bit of a background using uh, using the software. So yeah, so let's get started. I'm just going to start off with uh, a few simple ones, then gradually get uh, things a bit more interesting. Okay, so yeah, um, my function solve. So x squared minus 1 equals 0, and solving for x. Okay, so x is minus 1 or 1. Okay, and then the second one, we solve uh, x squared uh, minus 2x uh, plus 1 uh, equals 0. And then, yeah, so x is 1. Okay, and then now um, I'm going to use what's uh, called n solve. So that will give you um, a numerical value. So that'll be n solve. Okay, and um, be x cubed. Sorry, x cubed minus two uh, x plus three. That's equal to zero. And solving for x as well. Okay. And um, that obviously, yeah, you've got um, uh, a real part and uh, a complex part. So if you want to show the, uh, the real part only, you type in, so n solve. Sorry, let me just copy that. Okay. So then you get shown the real part. So these are the complex uh, complex roots. Okay, and um, I can also um, solve um, a simultaneous equation. So n solve, and that'll be uh, so let's say x squared plus y squared equals one, and then my other equation would be uh, so two x plus to x plus 3y equals 4. And then obviously I'm solving for xy because I've got two unknown variables. Sorry. Okay, so it's um, complex roots anyway. Okay, so um, now I can um, also use uh, another function called find root. So I'll do the equation, then I'll explain. I'll just write a little comment to uh, explain explain what I'm doing. So that'll be find root. So my function will be uh, cos x plus uh, exponential x. Right. Okay, so this is what I'm doing. So you're finding the root of uh, exponential x plus cos x near x equal to zero. And then that's our value there. Minus 1.74614. Minus 1.75 anyway. Yeah. And then uh, I'll do one uh, uh, matrix uh, linear linear equation. So like solving a system of, um, a system of equations using a matrix form. So my function will be linear solve. Okay, so linear solve, and then my matrix will be uh, so. So that'll be two. 
or minus two, one. And then, uh, then one, three, minus two. And then the other one, uh, the so three, minus one, sorry, minus one, minus one. Yeah, so minus seven, uh, minus seven fifths, and minus two, and minus two, and one over five. So those are my answers. But I could also do it in a different way. So um, assigning my matrix to a variable, so m, would be equal to. So I'll copy that. And then b will be that. And then linear solve. So we're using Yeah, so this is what we're doing. But then eventually what we do is we get the inverse of m and um, then multiply by b to get the values of x. So these are the answers, minus 7 fifths and uh, minus 2 and minus 2, 1 over 5. Okay, so I'll solve that. Okay, so yeah, so that was just a quick um, introduction on uh, uh, equation solving and just doing um, a matrix one and just your normal polynomials. So yeah, hopefully this is helpful and um, if there's any questions, you feel free to hit me up at the bottom. So have a lovely day guys and uh, thank you very much for watching.